So, I have a question for you. Which of the two, the following, uh, which one of these is creepier? The fact that I still carry the very first love letter I ever got? Or... That I used to use one of these to pick up chicks. Does anybody know what it's called? Feel free to yell it out. Okay, there's multiple answers coming at me. So I heard, I heard two different things. I heard somebody say fortune teller, which is absolutely right. It is known as a fortune teller because when you were a little kid on the playground, this is the item that would tell you like who your next boyfriend or girlfriend was, would tell you if you're going to live in an apartment, a shack, a house, or a mansion, all that type of stuff. For real. Uh, but then I heard somebody over here absolutely correct say it is also known as a cootie catcher. Which I always thought was a strange term because, like, when I was a little kid, the last thing I wanted to catch was uh, cooties, yeah. I actually got vaccinated myself. Anybody else? Vaccination is a big deal right now. Circle, circle, dot, dot. Now I've got my... Well, like, apparently this side of the audience has also been vaccinated. It's very good. Uh, okay, no cooties coming from over here. Uh, all right. So, Karen... If you recall, this is how these work. You open and close them, and it, it, it'll tell you, you know, you have to make some choices. So, so here's what we're going to do. Uh, I'm going to ask you to make a couple different choices, and we'll see where this goes. Because, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. So, Karen, um, do you have a favorite number? Not really. Okay, thanks for playing along, Karen. <laughs> My first instinct about you was correct. All right, I should have moved on. You're like, I don't, I'm not, I don't want to look at the magician. No, 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 you're doing great. No, Karen, um, of these four numbers right here, would you pick one? Seven. All right, fantastic. Thank you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I don't care who you are, you can't look cool with a giant cootie catcher. So, um... Now, Karen, there are inside the inside the cootie catcher. There are some shapes, and uh, the shape that you choose will tell me a lot about you. So, you're, here are your choices. You have the choice between a heart, which tells me a lot about you, or you can go with a diamond, which would also say quite a bit. Um, an arrow. Uh, so we have heart, diamond, arrow, and uh, a uh, parallelogram. So we can go with a heart, a diamond, an arrow, or a Parallelogram. Karen, your choice. Oh, so glad you did. I can't spell parallelogram. Thank you very much. Oh, that's good. You said heart? Okay, heart. H-E-A-R-T. All right. Karen, in order for this cutie catcher to tell you something about your, your future, there's, you know, fortune, future, all that stuff, you have to be willing to tell us something about your past. So, we have the seasons of the year, summer, spring, winter, and fall. Were you born in summer, spring, winter, or fall? What do you say? Fall. Okay, we're going to lift up the uh, flap that says fall. We're going to see what it says, but let's just pretend that this had ended differently. Let's just pretend that it had ended on the diamond. This, this is hypothetical. It didn't. But if it had, it would have said, you will have great wealth. It's a really good fortune, Karen. It's, it's not your fortune, though. That's, that's OK. Uh, you said, uh, I think you said fall. Is that what you said? You were born in the fall. Let's see what it says. It says, you will have 13 kids. So these things are, uh, these cootie catchers are total crap, actually, so they don't work. Um, but, uh, but there is a playing card attached. You have a red back card, I have a blue back card, stuck to the cootie catcher. This, can you hear, pull your card up, just like that, I'm gonna, they're going to face back to back. So my card, I'm looking at it, you're looking at yours. My card is a red card, like a diamond or a heart. Is your card a red card, yes or no? It is. This is a number card, not a picture card, like a two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, or 10. Is your card a number card? Ooh. 
On the count of three, I'm going to turn mine towards you. You turn yours towards me. If they match, we will both hold them up and show them to everybody, and they can verify that they do. One, two, three. I've got the four of diamonds. You've got the four of diamonds. Show them! Uh, 